Hello and welcome to IEM Labs. Today I will show how to find any Android device location using Seeker tool. So first let us start by downloading the tool. So from here I will go to google.com in my browser and I will search here Seeker GitHub. From there we will visit the first link uh, by the white 4T Seeker. So this is the link from here. We will just scroll down and we will follow these four steps to install the tool. So let us open the terminal. Once the terminal is open, I will first enter the sudo mode so that I can do the installation. So sudo hyphen s and then I will provide my password. So here I am in the root mode. Now from here I will copy first we will git clone to download the tool folder. Enter. So now the git is getting cloned and it will be downloaded. Once the git is downloaded we will just need to move into the folder. CD seeker. Now I am inside the seeker folder. Next I need to grant permission to the install file. So we will use chmod777 install.sh. Enter. The permission is granted. Now I will just use dot slash install.sh to install the seeker tool. Let's wait for the tool to get installed. It will take a bit time to get installed. Let's wait. The tool has been installed successfully. Now I will use Python 3 to get access to the tool. So the command is Python 3 space seeker dot pi space hyphen t manual. So we will start the tool in manual mode and also we will be downloading ngrock to generate the link. So I will just click here ngrock download. So let us download ngrock. As I am using Linux, I will download the Linux version. So here is my ngrock, I will just extract it and in a new tab, I will start the ngrock tunnel. Here also I will type sudo hyphen s and I will enter the root mode. Then I will go to the downloads folder using cd command. And from here I will start dot slash ngrock http 8080 because the seeker tool works on 8080 port. So here my ngrock tunnel is starting. Now I will turn on the seeker tool. So here are four templates that I can use near you, Google Drive, WhatsApp and Telegram. I will be using the Google Drive template. So I will choose option number one. So it is asking to enter a Google Drive file URL. I will just enter a random number here 123456 and enter. So now you can see that this port 8080 is starting and the PHP server is online. So once the PHP server is online and the ngrock tunnel has been created, I will just need to send this link to my user. As the user will enter this link, they will be asked to grant uh, permission to a Google Drive file. So I will be using my own mobile. So let me just quickly type the link dot ngrock dot io. As soon as I will open this link, you can see that the HTTP request is getting successful. So now here I got a screen where there is a Google Drive screen asking for permission for a file. So I will click on this request access button. Now it is asking my device location as always Google asks. 
so generally i will click on allow as soon as i clicked on allow you can see that all my device details came here so what details came here i am using android 9 its linux platform cpu cores ram a public ip my continent name country region city my isp and most important is my latitude longitude and all the details now here is the particular link using which i can see the exact location of the target device who has opened the link so let me just quickly visit this google maps link and you will perfectly get my location here in fact the location has been also saved in a csv file so here this is my perfect location so this is how using the seeker tool we can find out any device location just by sending this link thanks for watching the video do like share and subscribe our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon thank you